hey love muffins <laughs> i said hey love muffins <laughs> how is everybody doing on this good thursday evening hopefully y'all had an amazing day hopefully it was full of peace and prosperity um my daughter stood me up we were supposed to be going to eat some uh, mexican food but uh i ain't heard from her now she do her like she do me uh, I didn't answer her. I saw her text for like four days in a row, but I had every intention of answering her. Then I got hit with the text this morning like, okay, if you don't call me by 3.57 p.m., I'm pulling up. <laughs> yes, my kids be on me like that. <laughs> they be on me. If I don't answer her call, she'll call other people like, did you hear from mama? Just to make sure somebody heard from me. If ain't nobody heard from me, she definitely pulling up. <laughs> But oh, she probably got tired up and probably was tired after the daycare babies. Uh, so we're rescheduled that for another day. It was okay. I still had a chance to do some stuff. But I said, let me get on and do one more read for the PM and see what we got going on in the ether news. Um, child, see how oh, divine feminine child, you done broke somebody's heart, or either somebody was trying to break your heart. Take it how it resonates. Somebody done, somebody's heart got set on fire. Yeah. Damn. Probably somebody that came in playing with you like you wasn't a divine feminine in this boy. Yeah, look, drinking the coke, child. Prayer in reverse. Somebody feels like their prayers ain't being heard and they fed up. Somebody is fed up to the highest level of festivity. <laughs> Damn. Heavy on the divine feminine. Oh, yeah, Divine Feminine, you the one that's fed the fuck up. One, four, four on the clock. You fed up. What You you know what you fed up with the no-strings-attached-ass connections? Somebody wanted a no-strings-attached connection with a Divine Feminine? Not never is it going to happen. Not never is it. Exactly. Not never is it going to happen. And somebody is having an ego death right now. Somebody feels like time is running out. Ooh, heavy on the drinking the coat. But collective, you are moving on. You are free from whatever that connection is. I ask my ancestors, my angels, my spirit guides, as well as my higher self to please assist with this read. Uh, yeah. <laughs> please remove any of my personal thoughts and feelings so that they do not influence the read. Any negative energy? Yes, that it will be trying to send it tenfold. Who's the guide for say? Yes, for Cover me up. These motherfuckers here. They put a damn sign out there that said bump. Child, somebody ran over the motherfucking sign. <laughs> that motherfucker landed in the middle of the street. <laughs> we got no strings attached. Came out any damn way. Child, to the fake busy in reverse. Um, Collective, you busy for real. Um, You ain't got time for this shit. Yeah, lot, toxic lifestyle. You don't do toxic. Yeah, somebody finna get some badass news about this. Uh, Somebody finna find out somebody for the shady as hell. And mirroring, someone was mirroring someone's energy. Somebody wasn't vibrating high for real. Somebody was just pretending that they were. Take it high. I, listen, I can't make it up. Sweet talk in reverse. You ain't trying to hear it collective. If they were trying to make you heartbroken, um, that shit didn't happen. Yeah, reckless sex in fucking reverse. Yes, my divine feminine, do we do not do that. The fuck? Running in reverse. Somebody wanted you stuck. <laughs> I don't know. They wanted you stuck, but uh, you said goodbye. Pop the question in reverse. You like you? I feel like somebody may want to try to propose to you. This may be someone that may have backstabbed you, love bombed you, played mind games and shit. Why the fuck would they think that somebody want to marry them spirit? Why no? Why would they think that? I feel like people need to be very mindful of what position that they come into someone's life as. Because for me, if you come into my life um, at a certain position, that's where you at with it, right? Okay? It ain't going to be no upgrade. Somebody thought they was going to get an upgrade off a of no strings attached connection. I, I can't make this shit up. Collective and you like goodbye to, to whoever this person is trying to sell some type of fairy tale around this motherfucker. What? Give me something on this. I don't know why the fuck they think that you would look at them like they were marriage material. My nose is going crazy already. Yeah, exactly. That's what you was looking at them like they was. A whole jackass in this motherfucker. See, a real divine feminine is going to look at some shit like this. Like, what the fuck? Especially with the reckless sex shit. It's like, this is, once again, when you don't give a fuck about yourself. I don't give a fuck how good somebody look. I'm not, I'm not going to bed with somebody day fucking one. That I just met. I don't know anything about. 
that shit is dangerous as fuck. I'm just look, jackass to I miss you in reverse. Yeah, collective, you ain't then you have zero time for the bullshit. All the same damn cars popping the fuck out this bitch. <laughs> say my way or the highway in fucking reverse somebody having a whole ego death yeah you're not interested in a thug collective a thug that may be married you know what exactly this is exactly what the fuck is gonna happen to energy like that in your presence collective somebody be getting uh connecting with jezebels with secret accounts and shit somebody might like have four or five different accounts Somebody like, and they use different accounts to talk to different women and shit. Somebody doing way too much to hide a bunch of bullshit. You know what? Give me, give me one more on this one, child. Uh, child, pop the question in the upright. Somebody gonna pop the question to you, collected, but it's not gonna be somebody in this energy. I feel like for a real divine feminine, she's gonna attract a real divine masculine. Someone that cares about themselves. Someone that's not, um into reckless sex and no strings attached and my way or the highway somebody that's going to be very secure within themselves oh the fuck i was doing good today i was feeling all right <laughs> no strings attached to commitment you know what all in one and one and all in reverse collective you like here to the now 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 Huh. somebody had intentions of trying to rob you for your riches and your riches could just be your spirit i choose well to the no strings attached hell yeah collective you choose well you're not choosing this somebody wanted you to choose this but it's like this ain't nothing to, this ain't nothing to fucking want heavy on the riches in reverse Give me something on this no strings, child. Fuck. Somebody basically wanted to waste somebody's time. Because this shit is a waste of time. Any no strings attached connection is a waste of fucking time. I'm at a point in my life, I'm 51. If the shit ain't going somewhere solid, then I'm good on the edit. For real, for real. Uh, okay, exactly. To a real divine feminine. I said that. Divine feminine was the first energy out here, baby. Big peacock energy. Plenty. Be open for great things. The fuck? Patience in reverse. I can't wait. The fuck? To the trust. Mm, shit. Give me something. Give me something on this damn. No strings attached to the transformation. Wow. No strings attached to time for a change. Okay, so you may have a masculine out here, man, that may be feeling like. It's time to grow the fuck up. Somebody busy in real time because they need to. Somebody's busy in real time because they're tired of waiting on something. I can wait in reverse. A note. Okay, we got reckless sex in reverse to the release and let go. Somebody may be feeling more confident within themselves. Somebody may watch a lot of sunsets or sunrises. And someone is releasing a lot of emotional baggage too as well with these, because these is um, feeling like tears to me. Somebody is releasing a lot of pent up um, grief. They may have been using sex to cover up whatever this grief is. Running in reverse to vitality in reverse. Somebody's tired of running from something. I said the other day, I had... <laughs> okay, is that this energy? I had... A, I got a download the other day. <laughs> that shit funny. And it was this exact same car that came out. This running in reverse. And then I seen a truck go past. I think I said this that had that said road runner on the side of it. And I feel like whoever this masculine is, is that they deal with no strings attached relationships because they didn't want to deal with the emotions. And I feel like the second that they got a whiff that somebody had emotions or feelings or that they were developing most uh, 
emotions or feelings for someone, they would run like the dickens. And I feel like somebody is tired of running. Somebody wants to face their fears. And I feel like face their fears about love. Somebody wants to stare that demon down and find out why they're so afraid of it. I, I can't make this shit up. We got pride and ego in reverse. To the acceptance. <laughs> it says come into terms with yourself. Somebody knows that they need to be more disciplined. I'm telling you, magic in reverse. Somebody doesn't want to be... Exactly. Okay. Okay, well, shit, it's starting, to, it's starting to look all right. We got thug in reverse. Somebody may be wanting to grow up. And we got magic in reverse. I feel like this person, if they used to be manipulative, they're being very mindful of what they're projecting to other people. And they want to make sure that what they're projecting is the truth. And then we got, I choose well to pop the question. Somebody feels like a choice that they're making in their love life is a positive one with this I choose well. Once again, this may have been somebody that was once again um, used to the no strings attached relationships because somebody didn't want to deal with any type of emotions. But with this release, just let it go. I feel like somebody is really purging a lot of grief and a lot of fear. That's a beautiful thing. That's always a beautiful place to start. Where are we going from here, Spirit? That's just all leadership. Yeah, we got forgive and learning. I can't make this shit up. I see it up, up here. Somebody is releasing a lot of grief. Somebody is releasing a lot of fear here. It says, as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. I feel like somebody is finally being open to love. And this is somebody that ran from this shit, okay? This is somebody, hell yeah, to give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. I feel like somebody is finally trying to grow the fuck up. Love yourself first in reverse. I'm telling you, somebody didn't have a lot of love for themselves. And when you came along collective and showed this person some real genuine love, they got scared as fuck. Somebody hit the gas. But with this vitality in reverse, though, somebody is tired of running from their emotions. Somebody might have did a lot to cover up the pain. You deserve love in reverse. Yeah, somebody didn't think they deserved it. So anytime somebody would come along and show them some type of feelings and some type of emotions, it would stir something inside of them that they didn't want to face. Huh. And I said they feel like you could be the one with this pop the question to the I choose well. Somebody feels like you're a beautiful, a beautiful choice. I don't know why I was going to say a beautiful choice. Somebody feels like you are, you're a beautiful choice. Romantic feelings. Hell yeah. Somebody is really starting to um, honor how they feel. Give me something on this running in reverse. This vitality. Somebody tired of running. <laughs> Chemistry. It's running in reverse. Yeah, get to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. And somebody had some ice to crack from around their heart. Let go of control issues. To the my way or the highway. Somebody had a lot of, somebody, I feel like somebody didn't have a lot of control as a child. So, and when they got grown, it's like they overdid the control. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Mm -mm, somebody hit the motherfucking gas. Somebody hit the gas. Give me something on this my way. But somebody is coming to terms with themselves though. 
Shit, exactly. To the damn soulmate, to the chemistry. Wow. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. And yes, this is your soulmate. Okay, spirit is saying shuffle this. Okay, give me something on this my way or the highway in reverse to acceptance. Somebody is starting to accept how they feel, my nose. <laughs> ah, shit. That is funny. Give me something on this my way in reverse. You deserve love. You are lovable in reverse. I feel like somebody is starting to realize that they ran away from love because they didn't feel like they deserved it. Somebody is really coming to terms with that. And I feel like they're coming to terms with why they feel that way. A parent may not have showed them a lot of love. Healing family issues in reverse. Somebody is realizing that a lot of their trauma came from their family. Yeah, thug in reverse to, mag to magic in reverse. Somebody is realizing that it's safe to love. It is safe for you to open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. And I feel like this person came in your energy and they felt it and it scared the shit out of them. But somebody is realizing that they don't have anything to be afraid of. Exactly. Pop the question to the heart-to-heart -heart conversation, to the I choose well. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other, to the passion. I feel like when this person does um, open up to whoever, um, whoever the person is that has them in this energy of wanting to change, I feel like it's going to be so much passion between these two people because they're going to be able to be completely honest and transparent with one another. Allow your heart to, and soul to sing with joy. I feel like someone brought a lot of joy into this person's life. And they like the way this feels and they're trying to understand why they were running. They're trying to understand why they didn't want any emotional attachment to you. Because anytime you see the no strings, that's... um. Lack of emotional intelligence, and I feel like somebody is growing emotionally. And they're understanding why they ran. Somebody is breaking a generational curse. And this may have been a curse on the men in the family. A lot of men in the family may have did the no strings attached. And this masculine may be forgiving the people that led them astray, which is a beautiful place to start. That's a good way. Once again, we have release and just let go. Somebody may, be, um, may have been harboring a lot of resentment towards the masculines in their life because they felt like they led them wrong. Mm. Somebody only saw like pimps and players. Yeah, courage in reverse. Somebody got scared and something. Somebody came across a divine feminine energy and got terrified. Liberation in reverse. And they realized that they were bound. Signs in reverse to grief in reverse. And I feel like the signs in reverse is somebody not wanting to accept the fact that they were grieving. And someone surrendered. Damn, that is beautiful. Okay, I guess we take another. This is deep. Somebody is really starting to accept themselves and come to terms with themselves. Somebody may be coming to terms with the fact that they were very arrogant, very selfish, very stubborn. Yeah, and they're freeing themselves. Whatever change this is that someone is going through, it's freeing them. Yeah, I can't make it up. Time for a change to the inner power. In forgiving people, somebody is realizing that they're taking their power back. 
Give me the courage and the power to do what must be done. I can't make that shit up. And they know what must be done is they have to let go. We got to let go out here twice of whatever this reckless sex is, whatever this uh, promiscuous behavior is, whatever this fears of not being emotionally attached to someone, somebody has to let it go. Somebody is realizing that they were disconnecting themselves from a divine flow. They was discon disconnecting themselves from love. I can't make it up to the damn refrain. Somebody is refraining their thinking. This is happening for me and not to me. Exactly. And when this person learns to accept themselves, baby, their life is going to grow in so many beautiful ways. I can't make it up when they learn to love themselves. Oh, I love this. Oh, somebody is realizing that they do deserve love. Self-love to the thug in reverse. Let the wall fall that separates me from my own vulnerable inner child. I long to take care of myself like never before. So you have a masculine out here that is really learning to take care of himself. This is someone that is not being manipulative here with this magic in reverse. This is someone that literally wants to take the handcuffs off. They want to take the handcuffs off. And I feel like the handcuffs is whatever this frame of thinking was. It had someone bound. Not only did it have them bound, but it had them missing out on some beautiful things in their life because they didn't want to be attached emotionally to anyone. Hmm. I feel like when these, when these two people have this heart-to-heart -heart conversation, it's going to clear a lot of negative energy out of whatever this connection was. I can't make it up, baby, and replace it with love. Come through, spirit. Oh, I choose well to love, to pop the question, to passion. This is a beautiful. And Spirit saying that is the right action. Come through, Spirit. Somebody was ungrounded. Somebody wasn't, somebody wasn't grounded in their emotions because they were terrified. I said somebody didn't, somebody didn't know what genuine love felt like. And somebody realized that they were pushing people away with this their stubborn, arrogant energy. And once again, with the no strings attached to the reckless sex, somebody just wanted just the emote. Somebody just wanted the 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 feeling, the lust. Somebody didn't want the love, but now somebody wants that. Where we at? Give me this. Yeah, somebody didn't feel like they were enough. Lack of confidence, self-sabotage, ego issues, and jealousy. Baby, to the damn love. Somebody is killing their ego. And once again, I feel like this is something that went on, and I feel like this is just generation after generation of men that were emotionally unavailable. Boat in reverse. They were stuck. They weren't getting what they needed. Damn, give me something on this no strings, this inner power to the time for change, the discipline, forgiving and learning. Somebody is really learning. They realized that they wanted no strings attached relationships because they were heartbroken. I can't make it up. They didn't get any love. Unconditional love in reverse. That means the people that were supposed to give someone unconditional love didn't give them that. It may have been a lot of back and forth, ascending in reverse, exactly. It wasn't something that lifted their spirits. Give me something on this letting go. Somebody, I can safely let go. Damn. I can't make this shit up, man. Spirit, come through and validate your girl. Keys on the ring and fucking reverse. You got many options, decisions, unconditional, unconventional, string-alongs, one-night stands to the reckless sex in reverse.
baby, I can't make that up. Somebody is tired of that lifestyle. If somebody has other women's like keys on their ring, like they might be giving motherfuckers their keys back. Because somebody is impatient right now. Somebody is tired. Somebody wants to be in whatever this connection is. Somebody wants to work on a partnership. I, I can't make this shit the fuck up. <laughs> somebody is breaking up with motherfuckers. And I and what you know what's standing out to the to me on this that is beautiful. It says stopping the pattern. This is a pattern of masculines in a bloodline where they didn't want to be in no uh, emotional connection with anyone, and someone is letting go of this frame of thinking. It says work on your partnership here to the working on it. It says the hammer. It says rebuilding. Somebody may be trying to seduce this person, but I promise you they are not interested in that shit at all. If this if a feminine is trying to throw themselves at this person, they just embarrassing they damn self. I can't make it up. Baby, you got the key to somebody's heart around this boy. Getting together perfect. Open your heart. Meeting the one. To the getting to know each other. To the reframe. Somebody feels like whatever this change is that they're going through, this is happening for them and not to them. Yeah. Come to terms to your, with yourself to the talking, interested, conversing more. Give me something on this. Somebody is burying their ego and they really letting their heart leave the show. Give me something on this my way in reverse. Somebody didn't think they deserved love. That is sad. This person may be watching you. Give me some. Wow. 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 <laughs> Aww. We got twin flame here. Two people that compliment each other. To the butterfly. Be lighthearted. Things coming to light, adapting, changing, and healing. Baby, I can't make this shit up to the damn Cupid's arrow. Oh, heart to heart conversations to Cupid's arrow. It is safe for you to love to things coming to light. expansion to the twin flames wow this is beautiful have faith love is coming surprise invitation or meeting and i said somebody is lit somebody is really literally giving motherfuckers their keys back man we got coughing here it's over for that shit and it said to the i choose well change liberation and transition growth I said somebody is growing up and they don't have a passion for whatever this was. If they had a passion for this, these no strings attached and reckless sex um, connection, somebody just don't have a passion for that anymore. They have a passion for you. This is a beautiful love story. Now, don't y'all get your asses in my chat trying to ruin this for whoever story this is. Don't get your ass in the chat with that. If this ain't your story, this is a beautiful story. This is a masculine that is growing up. I can't make it up. Stability, security, once again, growth. This is someone that is growing the fuck up. They end in connections with people that they don't feel like is a good choice. It says, I choose well. And what we say somebody chose, love. And this is stabilizing. This is stabilizing somebody. Permanence. Shit, whoever this person is, they ain't going no damn where. Period. I, man, I can't make this shit up. Pop the question to the motherfucking engagement ring. Because period. Thank you, spirit, for confirming that this is someone that wants to be married to someone. Partnership, commitment, eternity. I said somebody ain't going no the fuck where. No, somebody ain't going nowhere. Okay? I feel like you couldn't get rid of this person if you tried, collective. 
Focus on self, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, self-appreciation. I say it right here. Somebody is coming to terms with themselves. Somebody is murdering their ego. And the way they're murdering their ego is by honoring how the fuck they feel. That is beautiful. That's beautiful energy to be in. Whether you're a masculine or a feminine, take it how it resonates. Congratulations to you because this ain't no easy feat. Somebody is stopping a pattern in their whole bloodline of masculines that are not emotionally available. I'm telling you, somebody is balancing some things out. I'm to exactly. They letting go of toxic things. I said somebody is freeing themselves. We already see here somebody taking off the handcuffs, somebody taking the chains off. And I said the chains was this mentality of not getting emotionally involved with someone. I'm telling you, facade in reverse. Somebody's taking the mask off. Mm -hmm. And this is all divine time and happening, honey. You may have triggered this person collective into this healing. Hell yeah, somebody was toxic as hell when you met them. They didn't want to change. Shit, what made them want to change? Spirit. I can't make this shit up. Divine time into the damn divine masculine. Hell yeah. I said somebody is growing the fuck up. Somebody knew they was toxic as hell. Somebody knew they was repeating a pattern. I can't make it up and they got the courage to change. Baby, I can't make it up. And who helped them change? They spirit guides. Somebody's spirit guides is leading them. And they listening. They listening. They told you can't go in no, with no connection with no divine feminine and talk about no my way or the highway. It's a team effort. It's a union. It's working together. And somebody is realizing that, baby. This is beautiful here. Somebody was toxic and they knew it and they had the courage to change and they spirit team is on board with this. That's great. I love this. I love it, love it, love it, love it. Somebody is doing the work. Give me something on this up here. Awakening in reverse to isolate. This person pulled back from everyone and started caring for themselves. I can't make it up. Guarded to the vulnerability. Yeah, loss in reverse, rejection in reverse. Somebody may have been afraid of rejection. Somebody may not have been very confident. That's why they were guarded with their vulnerability. Because their inner child wasn't healed. You shit, somebody present now though. Damn. And once again, spirit guides assistance. Give me something on this running in reverse. I, I, I can't make this shit up. <laughs> come through, spirit. I can't make it up, baby. Motherfucking comfort zone in reverse. Clinging in reverse. I said somebody was clinging to this lifestyle because they thought it because they didn't feel like they deserved love. They didn't feel safe enough to love. Well, baby, Ace of Pentacles here. Somebody is definitely getting a brand new start. Ambition, prosperity, opportunity. North Node in reverse to higher self. Hell yeah, to the memories, nostalgia. Hmm. Something that you may have done or said, collected, made this person remember something. I said they watching you too. <laughs> Whoever this person is watches you. I'm not sure how, but they definitely do. <laughs> whoever this person is they're not talking to somebody they ain't open to receive nothing from nobody i said somebody is very guarded right now break up separation number somebody i'll put the x to some shit they ain't that somebody may not be um open to receive anything no messages or nothing they may have left messages un um not open from someone we got seeds in reverse um somebody may have found out that a child wasn't there it's taking how it resonates ace of um pinnacles in reverse um i feel like if this child isn't someone's then somebody is going to lose money 
Once again, communication in reverse. Somebody is not talking to someone. Somebody is done with the motherfucking party and this shit. Yeah. And that's because they're attracted to someone else. Or they used to be attracted to toxicity. I can't make this shit the fuck up. Somebody used to be attracted to toxicity. But once again, they're changing. Ooh, we and stepping right into their abundance. Damn. Okay. Storm in reverse. Self-love to expectations. Hey, self-worth. You have a masculine that is learning his worth. He is learning his worth. And not only is he learning his worth, he's understanding that he does deserve love. Man, I said somebody grew up where they wasn't supposed to be. They, 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 they wasn't supposed to accept a love offer. They wasn't supposed to put their feelings and emotions into a woman. That was the toxic lifestyle that someone had. And Spirit said, I'm speaking all truth here. Someone hadn't healed their inner child. And I feel like in their childhood, they didn't get a lot of love. They had a father or a father figure that led them down the wrong path with this no strings attached and reckless sex. And then I felt like from the mother, they didn't get a lot of love. We have love here in reverse. It may have been just all discipline. I say it's a delicate balance when you're raising children. It's a delicate balance between discipline and love. If you give them too much love, then they're going to be spoiled little shits. If you give them too much discipline, then they're going to be full of anger and rage. And I feel like somebody didn't get either. Yeah, and they were guarded because of that. They were resistant to love. Ooh, but somebody free now, baby. It's period. Rejection in reverse to the higher self. Hell yeah. Somebody has somebody has tapped into their higher self here. And Spirit say, I'm speaking all, I can't make this shit the fuck up. Spirit say, I'm speaking all facts. I'm speaking all facts. Two cards about truth out here. Somebody is breaking a generational curse here. And they going all in with this engagement to the pop the question. Party in reverse. Spirit said, Ace of Swords. If this person used to party, they ain't partying no damn more. Somebody sees the truth now. I, I can't make this shit up. Somebody sees the truth. Somebody is doing a lot of soul searching here. And I can't make it up. Communication to the damn union in reverse. I've been saying with these keys on the ring, somebody might be giving motherfuckers their keys back. It might be up to three women who that this person may have keys to their homes. This person is giving them their shit back. It's something about your nurturing collective, your compassion. So with the self-love to the nurturing, somebody is nurturing themselves. I can't make it up and they're having a whole breakthrough. Somebody is realizing that in their past that they were lacking. And not only were they lacking, they were suffering. Damn. Man, Spirit say I'm speaking all too. truth. Damn. I know. Give me something on this decisions I choose well. This is beautiful. Somebody is really and truly. Yeah, distance in reverse. If this person is distant from you, they're tired of being distant from you. And they're probably distant because, once again, they putting the nails in some coffins around this motherfucker. If y'all was on a timeout, somebody is over the timeout in this motherfucker. I said completion in reverse. Whoever this person is collective, you couldn't get rid of them if you wanted to. But somebody is in love with you, and they're finally accepting this. This is something that somebody thought long and hard about. If you think that this person doesn't think about you, this person thinks about you all the time. And it's making them really check themselves here. Somebody really came to terms with the fact that they were stubborn and arrogant around this motherfucker and egotistical. And that may have been why you stopped talking to this person. Give me something on this. Ish. Yeah. 
I feel like collective, you may feel like this could you you may feel like this connection is not going anywhere, but I feel like whatever these seeds that you and this person planted, baby, they are being watered. And I feel like they being watered by the ethers. This is someone that may not have talked to women unless they were giving them some type of finances. I did say play a pimp ass energy. Yeah, this is this is that person where if you aren't giving them no type of money or nothing, they was good. Yeah, somebody is growing the fuck up. We got divine masculine to the commitment. Somebody is growing the fuck up. Or somebody was committed to a divine feminine in reverse. But here's the problem. This masculine is growing spiritually. And whoever the feminine is, she's still in the fucking reverse. And this is how women lose their men. And I say this all the time. It's cool to have a woman with all the curves and shit, but is she going to hang with you through your curves in motherfucking life? And this is the woman that's not going to hang with you through the curves. She don't want to see this version of you because it's the motherfucking opposite of her. Ooh-wee. Yeah, she needs some inner child healing as well. The fuck? Where are we going from here, Spirit? Where are we at, y'all? 40? <sighs> <laughs> Perfect. I said up here somebody was finally um releasing a lot of bent uh, pent up uh grief or emotions here. It says, "Don't be afraid to say I love you or thank you to those you who deserve to hear it. Don't be scared of embarrassing yourself or appearing soppy." This is this person being very vulnerable and guarded with their energy. It says, "You will never regret a heartfelt I love you." Heart to heart conversations. Or a message of appreciation. You will only regret not saying it. This person may want to express themselves to you. I said somebody wants to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you, collective. And I feel like it's going to break a lot of ice. Where I want to go from here, spirit. Okay, let's go there. Let's go there. Forgive me, y'all. I'm trying to see how can I dig into this just a little further. I need yes, thanks. Damn, I can't make this shit up. I don't want to be who I used to be. You deserve better. Wow. Uh, yeah, somebody is realizing that their emotions were blocked. Somebody is realizing that their heart shock was blocked. It says, I was hurt by you, but this just may have been something. I don't feel like this person was hurt by you. I feel like somebody was expecting you to hurt them like everybody else did. Yeah, I can't make it up. People don't believe in me. I said somebody's childhood was just all discipline. It wasn't no love. It wasn't no encouragement. It wasn't any nurturing. It wasn't any compassion. And collective, you came along with that energy and somebody thought you was trying to cast a spell on their ass with this magic in reverse. <laughs> Yeah, I said passion over here. The heat between us is intense. You making somebody feel some shit that they didn't want to feel. Yeah. I, I can't make this shit up. I am better with my mind than my heart. And somebody is getting better with their heart. I can't make it up. I'm afraid to lose you. Exactly. Somebody didn't understand what you saw in them collective. And I feel like you may have seen the God in this person before they saw it in themselves. If I could go back, I would in time, I would have handled us differently. 
somebody may have came in with this no strings. Well, yeah, that's the very first energy out here. This no strings attached. That's what they were just used to leading with. I don't want to be who I used to be. You deserve better. Give me, let's let's dig into this, y'all. Give me something on this no strings. <laughs> I said that, yeah, hell yeah. It, it, it is all too much. I said somebody wasn't expecting to feel anything for you collective. And I feel like somebody's childhood too was all too much. And once again, you deserve better. Somebody didn't think they were good enough. They didn't understand what you saw in them. So they thought you was just playing with them with this magic in reverse. Somebody thought you were just playing with them. Somebody didn't understand the beauty. I can't make this shit up. Somebody can't under couldn't understand what the beauty that you saw in them collective. I'm telling you, you triggered the shit out of somebody. And I said, it's making somebody come to terms with themselves. Drama in reverse. Somebody is over the drama. I said somebody might be giving a, like, a bunch of motherfuckers their keys back. Why do I feel so lost to the running in reverse? I said somebody is tired of running. Somebody is tired of running from their emotions and their feelings. Not only about you, but about their life, period. Damn, I wish to be like you in reverse. And I feel like this is someone's feelings towards whatever father figure was in their life. They may have wanted to be like them. I feel like they don't want to be like that anymore. Man, I can't make it up, baby. Painful memories. I said something was all discipline. Somebody didn't get no love from either parent. Because the masculine couldn't have possibly loved them if they sent them down this road of no strings attached and reckless sex and not opening your heart to women. Like somebody really cheated someone out of the beautiful things in life. And I feel like somebody sees that now. I said, baby, right here, somebody sees the mother and truth about loving yourself. Somebody sees the truth. And somebody is also seeing that it is safe to love. Sex with you in reverse. Whatever this is, this is not about physical contact here. This is about somebody and somebody's spirit, somebody's soul here. Damn. Give me something on this painful memories to you deserve love in reverse, man. Damn. Damn, life without you is hopeless, dark, and depressing. I miss your life. Oh. But somebody is on the right track, though. Somebody is really on the right track here. Somebody is detoxing with this party in reverse. And just the, the most important part, though, is once again coming to terms with yourself. I don't want to be alone. This may be somebody that couldn't stand to be alone. That may be why they just picked up anybody. They just needed someone there. They may have felt lost a lot as a child. Now, I am the man in reverse. Somebody didn't feel like the man. Somebody felt, somebody thought that being with a lot of women would make them feel like the man, but it really just made them feel even more broken. And somebody is realizing that. They realizing that they were using all this shit as a cover for their emotions. Give me something on this. This person may have been trying, may have been hiding. Man, I can't make it up. This person may have been hiding the fact that they wanted to be different than the men in their family. They didn't want to be looked at as like soft or weak or something like that. But no, being able to be in touch with your emotions is the strongest thing that you can do as a man or a fucking woman. Because when people don't have control over their emotions, they don't have control over self. So no, that's the complete opposite. It makes you even more powerful to be able to be honest with yourself about how you feel. We got heart to heart conversations here. So I wish I could be fully honest with you. I feel like somebody is gonna come in and be totally honest with you and say, I need to hold back my true feelings for you. Somebody needed to hold back because they didn't because they didn't understand this. And then once again, they didn't want to look a certain way to the men in their family, which is crazy. So you have a whole generations of men 
that have been going down the wrong path the whole time. They were moving away from God when they were moving away from the love. And give me something on here. Wow. Somebody misses your compassion. Somebody misses your... No. Somebody misses your nurturing. Somebody misses the way you cared for them. And that we got the Ace of Swords next to this. Spirit said that's facts. But I feel like in the meantime, somebody is really learning to love on themselves. Why do I deserve someone like you? Oh, I said somebody doesn't feel like it's, it's, and this was drilled into somebody as a kid. And just by the parents, either action or inaction, this was drilled into somebody's head that they didn't deserve love. No one understands me but you. Damn. And I feel like you understand the real person, not the facade that this person put up. We did see facade in reverse with that mask coming off. It says someone is coming to terms with themselves. I was hurt by you. This person may have been very, um, you may have been very honest with this person, Collective. You may have been very honest with this person about their arrogance, about their stubbornness. I said that you may have walked away from this person. That triggered the fuck out of somebody. Heavy on the what do you see in me? Now, I think somebody is starting to see what you saw in them, in themselves. You mirror, you mirror that back to someone. Give me, give me something on this pop the question. I can't take it anymore. Somebody can't take it no more. Somebody can't take being separated from you anymore. We got distance in reverse. This seeds too. Somebody might try to get you knocked up. <laughs> Somebody might try to get you knocked up. Somebody is closing out chapters with this RIP to the damn pop the question. Somebody can't take being out of your energy anymore. Damn. Who we at, y'all? 52. I, man, I can't make this shit the fuck up, man. <laughs> I thank y'all so much. I appreciate y'all. I promise I do. I long for you, but can't express it. I am trying to heal my childhood wounds so I don't hurt you again. Damn. So this I was hurt by you collective could have been um, you being hurt by this person. Somebody doesn't want to do that anymore. They want to find out why they did it. And the reason why they did it is because they were petrified of the fucking emotions. They were terrified. I'm living with the consequences of my bad choices. I lost you and now I'm desperate to get you back to the I choose well. Somebody is getting rid of all these bad choices that somebody used to make. They ain't making them bitches no more. You understand me better than anyone else. Your eyes can see into my soul. I can't hide from you. I said that's to this. You, uh, you triggered me. I said that you, first of all, collective, you ain't doing no drama. And I said that you may have been very guarded with this person when you saw this energy that they were in. So you just pulled back. I felt like you might have kept it 100 with them about it. Like, this is not what you into. And um, somebody is just like, I can't make this shit up. I'm trying to bury my love for you because I can't be with you right now. I ruined our relationship. Somebody feels like they came in wrong. But I feel like somebody's going to try to end strong, though. <laughs> they came in wrong, but they trying to end strong. I feel like you walking away from this person was the best. Uh, exactly. Exactly. That's beautiful. Th that's, uh, that's beautiful. Somebody definitely came. Somebody definitely wants to end strong collective here. It says, I want to show you who I really am. I'm ready to bring down my walls and share my true feelings. I'm telling you, somebody is in love with you collective. And they are really um chipping the heart, the, the fucking ice off of their heart. Once again, you understand me better than anybody. Your eyes see into my soul. Mm. 
Damn, give me something on this running in reverse. Somebody was taught some bullshit. Man, I'm telling you, somebody was trying to impress their family. Somebody was trying to impress the masculines in their family. By being on this hardcore, yeah, oh, just a, a no money, no talk ass energy. And somebody was finna let something really beautiful go, go by. I can't go against my family. I let them have too much control over me. I'm stuck now. Damn. And to the I'm a better person because of you. You inspire me to heal and grow from my past experiences. Damn. Collective, you have inspired somebody to really figure out why they who, why they was in the energy that they were in. I need to be alone for now. I need to make sense of my intense feelings. I don't want to feel this way. Yeah, somebody is really coming to grips of why, that why they do the shit they do. And I say that all the time. I don't never judge nobody. I always try to figure out why. Because that's where your healing going to be is in the wise. I, I mean, because period, I'm telling you, you made, you changed somebody's way of thinking, baby. To the getting to know you. Somebody wants to know more about you. I feel like the more they learn about you, the more they want to get to know about you, baby. Welcome and love. It says, I can't hide my true feelings anymore. I want, it, listen, I love you and want to spend my life with you. Man, come through, spirit. Man, exactly. I said somebody was terrified in this motherfucker. I've lost faith that real love exists. People have lied and cheated on me. I'm afraid to open my heart right now. I said that, right? I'm afraid to open my heart now. I feel like this is the energy that someone was in. We've seen the divine feminine in reverse. So hell yeah, she was cheating and scheming and all kind of crazy ass shit. My emotions are like a roller coaster. I don't know what I want, but I'm trying to figure it out. And I'm a better person because of you. I feel like somebody figured it the fuck out, collective. Somebody figured it out. We need to give this person a lot of love and a lot of encouragement right now. Because it takes a lot to do this. I say all the time. People act like they want to be the chosen ones. You want to be enlightened 5656 five, six on the fucking clock as I say that. But damn it, no. You got to peel back layers and layers and generations and generations of motherfucking shit that we've been taught. That is for our, not for our highest good. Damn. And somebody is realizing that shit. Somebody is going through this painful memories, man. It says, I'm selling for the life I thought I wanted, but it's empty without you. I still fantasize about you. And that's in motherfucking reverse. Somebody ain't settling for shit. Somebody's not settling anymore. I feel like with these no strings attached to the reckless love, somebody was settling. Somebody deserved better and they starting to realize it. Somebody may be working on their finances. We see fake busy in reverse up here to the impatience. Somebody can't wait. It says, I'm focused on my career and my finances now because I don't want to struggle again. I'm afraid to share that. This person may have struggled as a child as well. So somebody didn't get no love. They didn't get no real guidance from the masculines. And then they may have been in poverty. So this shaped to who somebody became. They may have been selfish and stubborn and no money, no talk because they didn't want to be... Um, they didn't want to be poor again. Somebody didn't want to be in lack financially. Damn. This shit, that shit in reverse like a motherfucker. It says, I have toxic people and situations in my life that keep me from being with you. I'm too weak to fight in motherfucking reverse. Shit. Somebody coming out swinging. I said over here, collective, somebody want to finish strong. They may not have been able to come into a connection with you because of these toxic situations. And somebody is putting the nail in the motherfucking coffin in this bitch. 5858 on the clock. Somebody is putting the nail in the coffin. Somebody can't take it no more. Somebody can't take it no fucking more. Exactly. It says, I did, it says, no, I can't make it up. Know your motherfucking word. 
It says, I didn't believe in myself or in you. I let my low self-worth ruin our relationship. I want us to heal together. Yeah, somebody want to finish strong, baby. Somebody wants to finish strong. And this is this is really beautiful energy. It says, I don't deserve you. You're too good for me. I took you for granted and treated you badly. I'm sorry. And baby, that is in reverse. That's in reverse. Somebody knows they deserve you. Somebody didn't know what to say to you, Collected, because they didn't know how to express feelings and emotions because they've been taught to bury that shit. Exactly. I know it's hard, but please be patient with me. I'm working to clear the path for us. I said somebody putting some nails and some coffins around this motherfucker. Somebody is done playing. Exactly. I, I, I can't make this shit the fuck up. It's too scary to admit that I'm in love with you. I've never felt love like this before. I've never felt love this deeply before. Do you feel the same way? Oh. Somebody wants to admit their mistakes to themselves as well as to you, collective. Says, I'm sorry for putting you in a third party situation. I'm miserable, but I'm miserable, but I don't have the courage to leave. Shit. No, no. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Are they leaving or not, spirit? I can't make this shit up. Yeah. Somebody is killing their fucking ego. I can't admit that I'm wrong. My ego comes between us. I hide my insecurities behind my foolish pride. But we already see up here that the pride, that, listen, the ego, he, he did that. He did that. He did that. Exactly. You understand me better than anyone else. Your eyes see into my soul once again. And once again, somebody is being focusing on their career. Give me one more on. Give me a couple more on this one, Spirit. And then we're going to clarify this with the tarot and get out of here. I know this shit going to take forever to load, yeah. Exactly. Somebody, as I said, terrified. I'm mad at myself for behaving this way. I can't control my fear or getting, uh, getting my heart broken again. Exactly. We said forgiving and learning up here. It says, I've never met someone like you. You're special. Please have patience with me because I am still learning. So somebody is really still going through this. Yep. Somebody is really and truly um taking a hard look at themselves. Okay. Where are we going from here? Okay, let's clarify this zero. Yeah, Queen of Cups. I said it's your nurturing here. Returning again to the same path, so to the same situation. Somebody keeps repeating the same situation in every connection that they go into. Somebody literally recreates their childhood in every connection. If they had a mother that was abusive or some, a mother that was back and forth that one minute they love you, the next minute they cussing you out. One minute they love you, the next minute they cussing you out. Somebody went and found a woman that treated them exactly the same way as their mother. And that's this no strings attached. That's the not really showing a lot of love and affection. And if they did show love and affection, they would counter it with something, um, and I don't want to say brutal, but they would counter it with something that's the complete opposite. Damn, ten of swords. Somebody laying that shit to rest. This is somebody looking back at their life. And the only thing they taking with themselves is self. They ain't taking none of these, none of the, none of the traditions from this family. They not taking none of that with them. Yeah. 
Shit, they somebody is charging towards you, Queen of Cups. <laughs> Damn. Give me give me something of Queen of Cups in reverse. Had this person confused. This may have been a mother. She may have been very cold. Yeah, she's not showing a lot of emotions, but she's very stern. Give me something on this no strings attached. Damn. Man, I can't, man, I, I can't make this shit the fuck up, man. <laughs> I can't make this shit up. Ace of Cups in reverse. No love, no feelings, no emotions. I can't make it up to a Cups in reverse. Somebody was not interested in getting in no connection with somebody. I said somebody was a somebody was afraid of rejection. Separation to the reckless sex. That means that somebody didn't have to have the emotional attachment to someone. Now somebody tired of that shit. Somebody tired. Somebody tired, boss. Make you can't make it up ten of swords. Somebody is tired. Give me something on this running in reverse. Somebody tired of running from their feelings. Block logic, emotional overwhelm. <laughs> Damn. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Insecurity. I'm telling you. Instability. Dullness of the mind. Damn, slothfulness. I don't know if this is the people that they were having, that they were having this reckless sex with wasn't valuable at all. Somebody's realizing that there's no value in no connection. There's no value in no love. Somebody is realizing that without love, that none of this shit really fucking matters. Chad. And this is hard for this person not to whip their wand out. I ain't gonna even lie to you. But they're getting more balanced, temperance energy. Damn, okay. Give me something on this running in reverse. Shit. Running in reverse. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, this person realized that they, why were they running from their happiness? Somebody's tired of running from being happy. Somebody's tired of running from their emotions. I can't make it up to the damn six of wands. Public victory. Progress. Confident. You have earned every one of your successes. So congratulations to whoever this masculine is because this person has been, this person has slayed a lot of demons in their life. And it was hard as fuck with this ten of wands, but they laid some shit to rest. And I feel like that's these curses. Yeah, somebody was a king of wands in reversing this motherfucker collected, but you spoke some clear communication to their ass. It says it expresses what's best for all. And somebody realized what was best for them was to go within and find out why they were like they were. And somebody is realizing that everything circles back to their childhood and what they were taught. I'm telling you, the tower in reverse. Damn. Give me something here. Yeah, somebody knew they was the devil. I said somebody knew they was toxic as hell, but they tired of the motherfucking drama. Somebody is realizing that the lifestyle that they chose and the relationships that they chose, that they were nothing but motherfucking drama, complexity, trickery, bondage, materialism. Somebody might have had a fetish with chains and whips and shit. Somebody might have been into s and and shit, but I feel like that was just somebody's way of being able to feel. Damn, the only time they felt was during sex. And I felt like regular sex probably didn't work anymore, so they had to go darker and darker around this bitch. That shit crazy, but okay. Shit. You are only limited by what you believe is possible. And I said somebody didn't believe that they deserve love, but I feel like they feel like it's possible now. Because they understand that it started with loving yourself first. Damn. To the motherfucking four swords laid to rest recuperation solitude self-love and recovery yes yeah and somebody is distressed and somebody and i feel like this is the divine feminine in reverse whoever she is she is pressed in distress because i said somebody got their guard up with every fucking body i feel like if it ain't divine feminine 
they ain't interested. And somebody is upset about this. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. They're okay. They stress because with this Nine of Pentacles in reverse, um, uh, somebody may be losing some finances. Damn. The chariot in reverse. Somebody chariot finna turn back into the pumpkin around this motherfucker. <laughs> Somebody chariot finna turn back into the pumpkin in this bitch. There's always another way to do something. Burdens, responsibility, blockages, damn, excessive pressure. To the strength tested. Hell yeah, assertiveness. Yeah, somebody was tested, baby, and they passed their test. Congratulations to this person. Teaching, morality, kindness, divine wisdom. Understand your beliefs, your values, and your boundaries. I feel like somebody is coming up with their own beliefs and their own values and their own boundaries, not what their what their family says that they it should be. Somebody's coming up with their own personal values. I can't make it up. Somebody is balancing things out. And whoever these three women is, I, mean, I can't make this shit the fuck up. Whoever these three bitches is, whoever the whoever these three women is that he had 110 on the clock, 1044 on that clock, fucking chosen and endings and beginnings. Baby, whoever these women is, baby, they giving these three bitches ain't celebrating no more. He's not celebrating with these women. Somebody is giving somebody their keys back. And, and I can't make it up and walking the fuck away. And they bad he walking away because the pinnacle's coming with him. Child, you know what? New approaches to old problems, new events and possibilities, enthusiasm for life and acceptance. Baby, I say what right here? This masculine is accepting himself. Hey, come through, spirit. Now the wands. This person been a warrior around this motherfucker. Somebody been going through a lot of shit. And it has ended and finished for better or for worse. Damn. Painful ending for somebody. I, shit, not you collective, not a cup. Somebody wants to come in and be romantic. And it's the sensitive part for me. I feel like somebody is really going to let their heart lead. It said before that somebody was better with 111 on the damn clock. Somebody was better with their head than with their heart. I feel like somebody is really finna follow their heart. Mm -hmm. Somebody is realizing that something wasn't true. We got disaster, lack of clarity, and self-destruction. And I feel like this is what as somebody is realizing that this lifestyle was self-destructive. Somebody is realizing that this lifestyle was self-destructive, baby. And somebody is standing in their strength and they are closing out cycles. Something is complete. Somebody complete. Somebody, yes. Somebody completed a um. Uh, a curse on their bloodline. Somebody freed their bloodline from this curse of no love and no money, no talk energy. Somebody is realizing where the true value lies. I can't make it up to the nine of cups. <laughs> Baby, I can't make it up to the two of pentacles. Somebody is really bad. Find balance in your life and build success. Change in circumstances. And it says everything has turned out well. Enjoy your success. Happiness, compassion. Trust in the universe, high-minded. Now, mind you, somebody went from not thinking they was good enough to knowing that they good enough. And we're going to congratulate that person and welcome them aboard the all. Uh, welcome them aboard the mothership. <laughs> welcome somebody aboard the mothership because they realizing how valuable it is to love yourself, how valuable it is to protect yourself. Baby, I can't make it up to the damn King of Pentacles, period. He said he not missing no opportunities because he couldn't open his heart chakra shield. Somebody said they opening their heart chakra around this boy. I said somebody wants to finish strong here. Somebody wants to bring some form of stability into your life collective. And I feel like you bring that to them as well. You bring, he bring it in with this security and stability. He's bringing in this divine masculine energy, baby. And you bring in this nurturing and this love, baby. That's the divine feminine energy. So this is going to be a beautiful balance here. Somebody worked through a lot of trauma. Somebody had a lot of trauma. Somebody didn't stand a fucking chance, man. But they came across your energy collective. 
they came across your energy collective and i don't know what you mirrored back to this person baby but it made them go within and come to terms with who they was and not only come to terms with who they was but learn how to love themselves and learn to realize that they deserve love and somebody realized that they pride and their motherfucking ego was lying to them somebody is realizing that their ego was the motherfucking devil in this bitch and they laying that shit the rest I said Cupid done shot somebody ass around this bitch. Somebody is laying shit to rest. And that's whoever these three women are. These bitches ain't happy. <laughs> so where you find this bitch? Well, the bitch ain't happy. <laughs> oh my God, I might have to go watch that. <laughs> but um, all in all, this is a beautiful read here. Somebody is really getting in touch with their heart chakra. Somebody is really realizing the, that they were led astray. And in, and in them releasing and letting this go, they let go of the curse. Somebody is letting go of the curse of no love. Somebody is letting go of the curse of no money, no talk, because that's a curse. Anything that make you walk away from the light is a curse. Anything that make you walk away from God is a curse. Anything that makes you walk away from love is a curse. And we're going to get out of here on that one. Everybody have an amazing night. Once again, congratulations to who all these masculines, because this may be the masculines as a collective, not just one individual. But congratulations to everybody that had the strength and the courage to go through this dark night of the soul, because I feel like that's what this was. Somebody that had the strength and the courage to look back at their childhood without rose-colored glasses, and somebody that's accepted for what it was and still understood that at the end of the day, regardless to what you have or didn't have as a child, you still deserve love. And with that, I'm going to release y'all with so much love. We out of here. Peace.